Hi, my name's Jim Clenchy, uh, River City Van, Spokane, Washington. Uh, I started vanning in 1976, had a big gap in the middle, started again about four years ago. Uh, this is my van, the Ranger Tang, uh, 1976 Dodge B200. What do you got in it? Uh, 360 uh, Mopar, standard stock, maybe a little bit of cam, can't tell, uh, kind of came with the rig. I got this about four years ago um, from Portland, Oregon, and uh, needed a little love, so uh, did what we could. Uh, here we are in the show, right? Beautiful show, great turnout. Shout uh, out to 50th Van Nash. Shout out to the, uh, all the guys that are making this happen. A lot of work, understand uh, the work you guys have put into it, and we really appreciate it, and uh, keep banning going. That's right. Shout out to the uh, Van Museum too. Hope yeah. you guys do well. Absolutely, absolutely. All right, so what do we got going on here in the front? So I uh, put a 73 uh, grill in it. Um, I had some chrome or plastic grill that came with it. Decided to go with a little more stealth looking stuff and got some uh, really nice uh, pinstriper from the Lawnster from our van club. He's a great pinstriper. He's here at the show if anybody needs some yes, pinstriping done. Yes, yeah, yes. great guy. Super nice guy. Way too inexpensive. Tell them to charge more when you guys go uh, see them. I will them. do that. We'll give them a tip. <laughs> um, I don't know where I came up with the monkey theme, but we kind of ran with it. And uh, my wife got involved, did some of the vines in here, and made us some nice lace cur curtains for it and stuff. Well, and I see also you got your uh, not only the, the entire uh, flare kit system, but you got the you went on with the, those are the LEDs, right? Yeah, headlights, yeah. yeah. Did some LED they headlights. For you? They're okay. The driving lights are actually better, but. Oh yeah. Uh, got the visor from Kurt Colas. Shout Kurt. out to Kurt. Oh yeah, Captain Kirk. Shout out for Captain Miss you Kirk. buddies. Too bad you couldn't make it. Yeah, yeah. Shout out for Captain Kirk. He's busy though. He's a he busy is a busy man. busy man. He's a busy man. Lonnie did me some bamboo uh, striping on there. Yeah, that was that, kind of that, cool. That's, that's not a decal. That's all uh, airbrushed and hand done. You got truck in there right under your door handle. Yeah. On both sides I noticed. Also, uh, explain this to us now. Just, you know, I'm a beer drinker, so, and I, I used to work in the restaurant business and got these free, so. Oh, the taps. Just, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had a spring on it, but that didn't work well, so I <laughs> had to make her a little more rigid. That's different. That's right. You don't got some different wheels there. you don't see much. Uh, yeah, Not right? the Kriegers, so. What are those? Oh, Vision. Vision. Yeah. Okay. A little different look. Yeah, absolutely. And the Coopers, of course. Yeah. All right, man. So let's see here now. So we got the doors. Door panels, you got all done up, nice. Some shag, baby. I got some shag, and got, got the shag. got the uh, texture of the monkey pods on there, and oh, the fur. So go. yeah, kind of got the whole thing going on. Yes, sir. You got your motor cover and your and your dashboard as well. All right, let's let's take a look on the inside now. Let me back up here a little bit so we can get a full full shot of the with the doors open. Did kind of the barrel bar things, kind of cool little homage to Mopar on the roof there, which if you don't tuck in there, you don't see her, so it's kind of nice. Oh, there you go, yeah. Wife did the nice curtains and stuff for me and got little flowers oh, in yeah, here to go with the nice. monkey theme. And then the part most people miss, you gotta zoom in on the uh, cover on the bed there. Cover on the bed. They got the old monkey head in there on the sheet. Oh yeah, they're gonna have to come around from the other side to check it. But, uh, explain a little bit more of this, uh, this swag you got hanging here. I just jungle theme to go with the jungle monkey part. Theme. Yeah. Okay. Got some monkey shoulder scotch to go with the monkey. Oh, we gotta have some. Of, we gotta <laughs> yeah. have some of that. We could do that. That one. <laughs> that that one's just uh, um, iced tea, though. I don't want to uh, waste good scotch, yeah, you know. Yeah, <laughs> right. You get into an accident, be all over the whole van. Yeah, we did the same thing with ours. Very nice little table here. Got the Bodies off a of beer shifter up there to go with the door handles. Oh yeah. Uh, Seattle Brewery, nice, good company. If you guys like good uh, IPAs, they're oh, yeah. super yeah, yeah. good. Yeah, yeah. Swapped out those uh, gauges in there. Those look stock, but they're all digital glow slip shift gauges. And uh, oh, cool, yeah. Kind of fun. I see you got your uh, your, your uh, overhead console up there. What all you got up there? Ah, uh, just some switches, and uh, I have a little uh, battery monitor. I have a solar system in here. I have a DC to DC charger, so it'll charge your starting battery. It will charge your house battery properly. Most people don't wow. charge their house batteries right, properly. Right. And you can plug a solar panel into it, which I have plugged in now, and it will charge my starting battery and the house battery. Nice. So I'm an old tech guy, so I love the old tech stuff. Yeah, you got to put your classic sunroof, of course. Yep, yeah, hard to come by now. Yeah, right? Yeah. I need to get a good new gasket for mine, just in case, oh, just to have. Yeah, yeah. Just to have. I think True I can enough. still get it. You 
got your signs hanging up here. You used to be able to hit him and he said something, but I think I hit him too many times. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right, let's see what you got Beautiful back here day. now. Yes. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Not really an arrangement thing, but that's as close as I could get. Yeah, that's close. I see you got the cow wing up there. No, this one's, I, I think this one was off a, a charger, not a charger, but a, some little car I found. I, I wanted to get a tri typical uh, NorCal wing or something, but the uh, wouldn't fit in the garage. Oh, it worked out well. So this is your solar panel down here? Yeah, so I plug, they got a little uh, plug in the back and yeah. works good. That is really nice. It is That's not really he it's not Hemi powered, but I like the orange, so I. That looks nice. Kind of cozy back there. Yes, sir. Looks like it. Absolutely. Okay. Did you do everything yourself? Everything but the paint. Uh, got the charger the there. I was oh, going to yeah. shout out to the adapter. I can't remember his name though, but thanks. He, he makes the adapter for those and it makes, yeah. this is probably the easiest upgrade I've ever done on a vehicle. Wow. <laughs> three screws. Wow, she's beautiful. Right. Very nice. And because with the 340, I couldn't put a compressor on it. Very nice. So this thing's got a compressor. I put the running boards. Now those are wood running boards. They are. They're, they're ash. The fiberglass. No, they're ash, and the wife came up with the idea of the black stripes to kind of tie everything in. Yeah, and yeah. Well, that definitely shows it off. Yeah. Um, we came from Spokane. It was 1,250 miles. We uh, we did three days. We had some mechanicals with the group, like most you know, long drives, you know. Mm -hmm. um, I did good till the second day. I lost a fuel pump, but we got her changed out in about an hour and a half, thanks to my son. He jumped on there and got her done. Um, the longest I'd ever driven this after, before that was about 200 miles, so it was a leap of faith. But she runs good.